Good evening and welcome to Retro Rust. This is episode 22 of the free video game collection. So, currently, this is the stuff we are selling in the collection. So, I posted all the uh, Chromecast things and there was a sat nav and stuff like that. I'm still waiting for someone to bid on the DVD players, but that's a nice £30 coming our way. Uh, this little pile here, so I've got a bid on that on eBay, uh, so hopefully should get about £6 back from that on the top one. Uh, these are on eBay as well, but they're just going round, so I'm probably going to trade those in, probably get about 50 pence trade in on those. Uh, all those Blu-rays and DVDs, so the Blu-rays, half of them are sealed, all the DVDs are sealed, so I'm keeping those. There was a lot more DVDs and other bits and bobs, but I've donated those back to the charity shop. Uh, I've got this little dish that I paid a pound for at Car Boot, so that's now listed on eBay as well. And these are three games uh, that I've also got listed on eBay. So as you've probably noticed in the collection so far, I do not collect any Xbox 360s. So anything that I do pick up along the way will either get traded in or, or sold on eBay. So as it stands, because I had to post that stuff the other day, uh, we currently have £33.70 in voucher still as well. And we are currently back in the negative. So with the stuff I had to post, uh, and I've also spent £22.50, which I'll get to shortly, we are now minus £25.10. But like I said, once we've sold these DVDs, uh got the money for that we're pretty much back in back in the black again which it which is the aim and hopefully we, we'll be will be even more in the black once i've gone through the stuff i've spent so why why are we minus 25 pound and 10 pence that is purely because i spent 22 pound and 50 pence in the charity shop so i've had quite a lot of luck in the charity shops so this is another little charity shop also i've not I've not got the individual prices but overall like i said i've spent 22 pound and 50 pence so uh the first thing i've got is this psp sonic rivals 2 really really nice condition mint condition almost the manual in there is immaculate uh the disc on the uh on the little cartridge that you put in the PSP is also immaculate. So yeah, really nice. And I will be adding that to the collection. Uh, the next thing, okay, not very exciting, but I've been watching so many different YouTubers and they always say, check the disc on Wii Fits. So I check the disc. Oh, it's a Wii Fit disc. However, that was slipped inside. So yeah, Wii Sports in a cardboard sleeve. Not very uh, not very exciting. However, the disc inside is in there and it is immaculate. So yep, yeah, I've already got a Wii Sports in the collection. So that will be getting traded in for voucher. The, the Wii Fit I'll just use as a spare case for now. Okay. Uh, the following, Sports Island, so that's nice and complete, everything's in there, so that'll be kept in the collection. Uh, the next one, we have We Think Fast, a uh, bit of a quiz game, again, nice and complete. All the discs on these are really, really clean as well. Uh, Wii Sports Resorts, very nice find in a charity shop, complete with a manual, it's got a little brief, uh, little leaflet in there so yeah really really nice uh disc again is immaculate the up the whole thing is immaculate so yeah really happy with that so that'll be adding to the collection because believe it or not i haven't got a wii sports resort in the collection but i have now so yeah this was <laughs> a really really surprising find a wii u game in a charity shop so yeah really happy with this again the books in there and everything like that. Really nice condition. The disc is immaculate. Uh, quite surprised with this because 
I need it for the uh, Wii collection, Wii U collection, sorry, anyway. Uh, I just expected it to be a couple of quid game, but it's not. It's actually a £12 game. So, yeah, really, 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 really happy with that. Okay. Uh, next thing I found was this PlayStation 3 game, uh, Fallout New Vegas. Obviously, Fallout has just dropped on... Amazon Prime, I think it is. It's supposed to be really, really good. I've not watched any episodes yet, but I will be shortly. Again, uh, really nice condition. I did give the case a little bit of a wipe because there was a little bit of a sticker residue there. Again, complete with the book inside and everything. So, yeah, really happy with that. Now, I'm not 100% sure if I've got this or not. Uh, so, I need to check uh, in my unsorted games room to see if I've got it to decide whether I'm going to keep it or not. But for now... Uh, I'm going to keep it in the keep pile. Okay. Uh, the next uh, four items are just uh, film related. However, uh, this one was brand new, sealed. Okay. So, yeah, I did a bit of research on that one. So, that trades into CX for £2. They sell it for a fiver. So, I've stuck it on eBay for £4 plus postage. See if I get any luck with that. If not, worst case scenario, CX for £2. Same again with this uh, Blu-ray, sorry. Uh, yeah, brand new, sealed. Same as the other one. I think they sell it for a five. I'll give you £2 voucher. So, I've stuck it on eBay, £4 plus postage. Next one, uh, this was a... Uh, a strange one because if I've not heard of a DVD or an old one, I normally give it a scan. So, yeah, uh, again, CX uh, charged about five six pounds for this, maybe a little bit more, I'm not 100% sure. Uh, yeah, really, really, if well, it's pretty, it's brand new, pretty much a disc. I don't think it's ever been played, but they're selling on eBay for about 10 pounds. So, uh, I'll stuck at that one on eBay as well for uh, four pounds starting bid, uh, plus postage. Worst case scenario, I'll just send it to CX for two pounds again. Uh, the last one, uh, I was uh, quite surprised with this. So, yeah, three disc collection. This is really nice. I'm not going to open it up, but yeah, married with children, uh, the complete fifth season. So, normally, uh, I wouldn't bother with looking at individual seasons, but I was a bit, uh, I was in this charity shop and there wasn't much, so I'd, I, I got a bit bored and just started scanning stuff. And this one surprised me because there was, uh, there was quite a few of the seasons there and I scanned the first season and it was like 20 pence trading. Uh, so I thought, oh, I'll just carry on. And they were getting more and more and more expensive. Uh, and then this one, uh, I got to this one. This was the last one that was in there, Married With Children. I scanned it, CX, signed it for 20, trade it in for £10. Uh, and about six or seven pound cash. Uh, I've tried to have a look on eBay, but I can't really find this one on eBay. So I'm a bit unsure what to do. So I'm a bit nervous about this uh, price, giving, CX giving you £10 voucher for it so i am just gonna go straight to cx uh for the first possible opportunity probably friday or saturday and just trade it in straight away uh just to get the 10 pound voucher and then go from there really so yeah that's pretty much where we're at with that so all that in total was was uh 22 pound and 50 pence with the sonic rivals being uh I think I paid about £4 for that, but normally I wouldn't, but because it's in such nice condition, uh, I thought I would, uh, yeah, and CX will give me £4 for it anyway, so yeah, really happy with that, so we've got like an a £11, £12 game, we've got a £12 game, that's I think it's 9 or 8 or £9, we've got another £8 game there, these are worth a quid each probably, so yeah, uh, that's like I said, they're selling out for 20. Then we've got these Blu-rays, DVDs, and we've got the Wii Sports. So yeah, I think there's about 84, 85 pounds worth of value in, in what I've spent. Uh, if I took it all to CX, because CX will take it all, probably looking at about a 40 odd pound voucher. 
Uh, and if I'm really, really desperate to get my money back, they will give me pretty much more than what I paid for all this in cash. So, yeah, that's what it's all about. Uh, obviously, I need to recuperate some of the money. So, like I said, this is the keep pile. So, I'm, I'm definitely going to keep that for now. I'm not 100% sure on the fallout. I really need to start monitoring what games i've got however i think i probably would have bought it anyway just to trade in for the voucher because the cost of it was uh, less than what cx will give me a voucher this little pile here is definitely getting traded in to cx and this pile here at the moment uh if i can sell it on ebay great if i can get 15 pound back and if i can get 15 pound voucher out of this i pretty much I, i'm happy Obviously, with the rest of the stuff they're selling, we'll be back in back in the black in no time. So yeah, really, uh, really interesting video today. Hopefully, uh, obviously in episode twenty three, the next one I'll give you an update on what we've done. Thanks for watching. Good night.